Pajama smell. Smells like it shouldn't exist. We'll leave that one to the side. a brand new video so today i have been second hand shopping so i've been to some jumble sales i've been to three jumble sales and a couple of videos ago i had a couple of comments because they couldn't believe that jumble sales are still going still exist and honestly they are today as i say this on the 25th of november there was bit there's been about six or seven jumbles on in one go in our local area we only managed to go to three because bearing in mind you've got to get to them some of them are at the same time so it can be difficult but we we went to the ones that we truly love and provide a good face basically that's what we've been doing today and i picked up a couple of bits and i really want to show you guys as i do it is 20 to 8 so it is getting a bit on now and i've been watching i'm a celebrity and that's on at half nine today it's normally on at nine but it's on at half nine so i want to get cracking so all across the years as i've been on youtube i have done quite a few secondhand shopping hauls now so the way i do my videos has dramatically changed but i do have a full playlist on my channel if you are new around here if you want to go and have a look if that's your kind of your type of thing to watch then i will leave that in the description below for you if you are new around here then please subscribe that would really help my channel and like the video if you like these type of videos but if you are a continuous viewer then i honestly i really do appreciate all of all your comments and i do have a giveaway coming soon so please watch out for that video and on that topic and um, i do have my kind of get decorate for christmas kind of video and that is going to be my first little festive video for the for the month for december and um, so that will be on sunday's upload so definitely worth sticking around for so let's just start off shall we let's just go with the first little thing that i picked up now if you can hear something in the background it could be my boiler so we've got the heating on it's like minus one degree at the moment since i last checked so it's getting quite cold in the evenings in the mornings now but we're just going to ignore that so you, hopefully you can just keep hearing me so i went to the charity shop yesterday and this was kind of separate to this but i kind of want to include it because i want to give it a wash and then kind of put it in my wardrobe so it's just this jumper it's quite basic to be honest if i kind of hold it up there so it's just this jumper i got some buttons as you can see it's just like that at the bottom these are the cuffs and you know what i thought this was really nice just to lounge about it this was from compton care and it did cost me a fiver which i thought was quite expensive but i kind of wanted to take it on at the same time and that was originally from sainsbury's but you know what i just thought with my joggers maybe like on a sunday and i'm just chilling around um this is the kind of thing that i want to be wearing so i thought i'd just mention that in this little segment but i've got my bag full of little bits from the jumble so let's cut let's see what we've picked up so i'm going to start with this first of all because this was an absolute steal now i've been seeing wreaths in tesco bnm all these different places basically and they're really expensive in my opinion 25 to 30 quid or more i find quite expensive for a wreath so i've been hunting in like charity shops and they have been a little bit more expensive in there like i'd say six seven quid because charity shops are getting they are expensive however i've been to a jumbo right and it was fantastic by the way and they had a few wreaths and i've managed to pick this up Right, it's got their little hanging thing here. It's still even got that, that uh, plastic thing at the top. But anyway, so this wreath, right, this is, this is what's on it, just so you can see. Absolutely beautiful, and that's the back. You tell me, that's easily 20 quid in my opinion, 15, 20 quid, or even possibly more. This cost me £2.50. I mean, you, you just can't deny it. So it did cost me 50p to get in the fairs. I did kind of not mention that, but it does cost you a little bit of a fee to get in. But they are churches. Like, I don't mind. It used to be like 20p, to be honest, but they have put the price up. But anyway, so that's the first thing that I picked up. And I thought that was absolutely beautiful. So I'm going to be putting that on my Christmas um, not a Christmas door, my front door, but I just thought that was such a steal for £2.50, considering they're just so much more than that. Another little Christmas thing, so I've got this reindeer, probably, probably didn't even need this to be completely honest, but it is just a silver one with all the little sparkles on, and that's it really, very, very odd. I don't know, I just thought that might be alright, next to the Christmas tree maybe on the floor or something, but that was... 
I can't remember how much it was. It might have been a pound, 50p a pound probably. But yeah, that's um, something else. I mean, I will be honest, there isn't a lot here, but it's just the principle of just before I go to bed or settle for the evening of me showing you. But anyway, so this is the other thing that I picked up. So it has got a bit of glitter from the reindeer. But I thought that was so simple and lovely. Like this Christmas tree. It's like a velvet material. So I'm not sure what's going on there. But I thought that was so nice and simple. So I'm going to put that in the living room. Um, but I absolutely loved it. So it, it cost me four quid that was 250 i don't know i must have brought something else from her but i don't know what else i don't know what else i brought from her but yeah so i I'll, I'll, I'll picked that up they had a whole um sorry glitter's getting everywhere they had a lot of books if you're a book lover they had a lot um but i saw this and i've seen loads of people go on about this and it just needs a bit of a wipe i'm not gonna lie but i've seen loads of people go on about this so tell me if it's not really anything good to be honest i don't know um but i saw this and it was 20p absolute bargain so all the pages are perfect it's only the cover that needs like a bit of a wipe but all the pages are almost like no one's used it and they've just donated it but they've got like you know these chicken kebabs just like really good and i think for 20p i mean you can't go wrong i mean even if like he was to gift these on i'm not even quite sure to be honest i just think that was really really good and you've just got loads of ideas so i'm actually going to flick through this because i'm actually finding it quite difficult to think of dinner ideas so i'm going to flick through this and just see if there's any inspiration that i can find um, i did get this fitness tracker this was 50p and um, i think i need to kind of charge it up but it looks all right to me i mean i was having a play with it earlier but it's just like this so I don't know, I think I just need to charge it and then connect it. I mean, it might not work. It might be absolute rubbish. But for 50p, I thought I'd give it a go because I've actually been um, trying to get one of these. But sometimes they can be quite expensive. I mean, I've said it before, but everything to me can be quite expensive. But like I said, for 50p, I thought I'd just give it a try. So on one of the jumbles or in one of the jumbles, whatever, um, they did raffles so you paid a pound you won every time but you took some gift bags now i purposely haven't opened these because i wanted to open these on camera and share them with you guys so this one looks quite expensive but it's just got the perfume shop on there and this red bag so i thought let's open them while you're here now there might not be any good um but like i said there was a pound each and you won a prize every time so some people won like bottles of wine and things like that so that's this bag's all right actually you can really use this again um so what have i got what have i got um individual blue for him now i'm not sure about that to be honest let's have a smell should we have a smell smells like it shouldn't exist we'll leave that one to the side but you know what every little help for the church you need so i'm just going to open this one now as well oh dear to be fair my mom got a couple of these and she got like link sets and everything like she really scored on hers so, like she had some really beautiful gifts but i think i've just done the short straw to be honest so in here i've got um i've got a dvd has anyone watched that? It looks like a sad movie, if I'm completely honest. I'm going to be honest, I ain't got a clue about this, but um, you know what? I don't know what to say. I'm going to have to skip this really quickly. But apart from that, guys, that is pretty much everything that I've got from uh, the Jumbo sales today. I mean, I did pop into Tesco. I did get some uh, Bistol gravy ready for Christmas. They've got this on offer at the minute for two quid rather than £3.80. £3.80 for some gravy. Now, I do just buy the cheaper one like the Lidl brand or whatever but I thought for Christmas dinner I'm going to treat ourselves to the actual beast style gravy and then I did just grab some uh from Lidl some stuffing mix oh we've been everywhere today and um, some stuffing mix so this one's for tomorrow and then this one's for Christmas I thought you know what I'm just going to pick it up and just you know I've been trying to organize I did upload a little short video on YouTube as well of little bits that I've got already so that's on my channel if you want to have a look at that it's only a 30 second video
And then for my latest now I've got three for two on on the makeup and I need some because I'm going back to work. So I've just got some uh, bronzer, that's the one I use or have started to use. And then I might, it might look like uh, I need to sort myself out, but I do use it, it is good. And then this is the foundation that I use. Um, I've used this for years and years and I've just never gone on to anything else and then I picked up some of this because it was three for two so I got this for free and it's just some gel nail, nail varnish but it's red and I thought because of the festive season I'll treat myself to some uh, gel nail varnish that is everything from today's video what did you think I mean my favorite item let's be honest is the wreath two pound fifty bargain of the day i'm not going to do it now because it is cold and dark so i'm just going to leave this for tomorrow morning when i wake up but i think that's absolutely gorgeous what do you think so guys i'm going to let you go now thanks so much for watching again like the video if you did and subscribe down below if you're not already i will see you on my next video which is on sunday and it is getting ready for christmas so see you there guys Bye. <laughs>